Microfinance institutions have, over the past three years, grown to a tune of 3.7 trillion shillings. However, according to the president of the Association of Microfinance Institutions of Uganda and the CEO, Yuga Ford Microfinance Limited, the sector requires about 2.3 billion shillings to acquire infrastructure that will increase digital uptake. We are trying to look out for the various uh, development partners uh, to be able to support uh, building a shared ICT infrastructure because uh, it is quite expensive for an institution. One member and most of our members are not the same size. So it requires a quite heavy investment uh, for an institution to have uh, a robust ICT infrastructure uh, that can be integrated with the various uh, digital channels. Uh, it will require an investment of about uh, two to three billion shillings. State Minister for Microfinance, Haruna Kasolo, believes the now stored SME recovery fund might do better if it's managed through microfinance institutions. This is also a challenge. It is giving me headache because this money is intended to, you know, to support my small people, those that really, whose business were affected by COVID, these SMEs. This money was put in BOU, Bank of Uganda. It is very hard for my people to access this money. It is very, very hard. It is very, very hard. Mama Prime Minister, we are pleading that really you direct that this money is removed from BOU and it goes directly to some of these financial, um, microfinance institutions uh, just to own lend to, to, to our members. It should not be left in the Bank of Uganda. So when we go back, I will definitely invite the Minister, Bank of Uganda, and the Minister of Finance, the Commission is here, so that we see that this money is accessible to you. With a new law on Credit Reference Bureau, it is hoped that microfinance institutions will make better use of these facilities to improve their omniscience administration of credit for the good of the businesses and individuals that borrow. Rachel Nabisubi, NTV Business.